How's it going everybody? It's Christian L here with Eat Like an Apex. This afternoon we are finishing up our Arizona food tour, our Grand Canyon food trip. We're at a place called the Raptor Ranch. The Raptor Ranch is a place that is influenced by the Flintstones and this place has an amusement park with dinosaur prehistoric themed from the Flintstones. You have a restaurant that I was interested in checking out. However, due to the pandemic, the restaurant is closed, but they have an outdoor street food spot. So we're gonna check out some of the food here at Raptor Ranch, check out some of the amusement uh, park attractions inside, and uh, just enjoy this time here as we uh, essentially conclude our food tour of Arizona. With that said, if you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, I hope you find time to subscribe. I greatly appreciate that. You'll find more food related, travel content on this channel. So I'm excited to show you everything in this video right now. All right, so I found out that we are in Valley here in Arizona and the spot that we're gonna check out later on right here after the uh, we check out the Raptor Ranch is called Sun Sunshine Delights AZ. Let's go inside Raptor Ranch, take a look at some of the attractions first. Okay, we're gonna head inside now, Raptor Ranch. And again, everything looks like the Flintstones, like, theme. Hey. Have fun. Thanks. This is the inside of the Raptor Ranch, kind of their convenience store, before you enter into the park. Okay, so it is a gift shop with snacks, treats, souvenirs you can take back with you. Nice little convenient section here. Ooh, okay. Bedrock City. Okay. So it's the age of the dinosaurs, prehistoric spot where they have like, like I said, a Flintstones themed rock homes. It really is pretty, pretty cool. Kind of reminds me of when I used to watch the Flintstones back then. Little Flintstones car right there. First I have my first guest, Sapphire, the mini oh, dinosaur. Look. The show is starting. Da, 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 da. Yeah. Yeah. It's the Jurassic Park song. It says Fred's house, so Fred Flintstone, the the icon for the Flintstones. We're gonna go inside his house right now. I would too. You really do feel like you're in the Flintstones. Push bell in case of fire. Here's a camera back in the day. That's exactly what it looked like. <laughs> School! Okay, so we're inside of the general store. Look at that giant watermelon. It's got eggs. It's huge. Oh, dinosaur eggs. Yeah. Open one. Look at the size of those oh, eggs. Okay. They're huge. Ooh, rhinoceros ribs. Ooh, they're, they're food. Yeah. Oysters. Yeah. Oh, you like your oysters? Seafood. Turn it. Looks like a pterodactyl meat. Giant pterodactyl. Oh, uh, that, that's, I bet you that's delicious. It's making me hungry. Hey guys, we're here at Sunshine Delights in Arizona. As I mentioned earlier, Valley, right? Valley community. I'm here with the owner of Sunshine Delights. This is Adelina, and she's out here at the Raptor Ranch preparing for the community. This pop-up. Uh, Mexican uh, Mexican food? Right? Mexican street food. Mexican street food. And I'm excited to be here. She's gonna prepare some food for us today and try the food and just enjoy the time here. So thank you, thank you so much. You're yeah, welcome. Watch her uh, do some magic. The tacos and the hot dogs. Okay. So I'd like to oil the tortilla a little bit so it doesn't rip. Okay. 
location because it's heavily trafficked. Oh, right, right. Because it's on the way to the Grand Canyon. Oh, I see. Love the hustling. Yeah, it's a hustle. What's up, Daniel? Yeah, okay. Say what? I don't know where I go. Okay. We'll be right back with you guys. No. Oh, this is so good. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Should I just throw my line like this? Yeah, go for it. Yeah. Fast? yeah. <laughs> 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 just just lay it yeah. down just like that, yeah. <laughs> So Lena prepared those tacos with expertise skill. I mean, she knows what she's doing. The food, the smells, just everything that's going on here. The ingredients that she has here. I'm excited to try the food here at Sunshine Delight at the Raptor Ranch. The bun, I like to crisp it a little bit. Ah. For, you know, right, the right. effect. So right now she's preparing uh, something called the Sunshine Delight, right? Which the is- Sunshine Dog. Sunshine Dog, which is the bacon wrapped hot dog. And I've had that uh, multiple times and I they're fantastic. Shout out to Nogales. Sonora, Mexico, because <laughs> that's where I'm from and that's oh. how I always eat in my uh, hot dogs. Oh, terrific. So I don't wrap it, but okay. I yeah, throw no. it. Yeah, okay, awesome, awesome. So this will be a little different in oh, that she kind of like uh, uses the uh, bits of bacon and I guess she'll be layering the bacon on top. Do you have a YouTube channel? Yes, yes. Uh, it's called Eat Like an Apex. Eat, check it out. Thanks, brother. Beautiful. Oh, and the salsa. That's, is that your homemade salsa? It is. I love homemade salsa. Yes. Crazy, crazy. So then you do that. Yeah, it tastes awesome. Lena. Thank you. Uh, are you from here or what? No, I'm from Pennsylvania. Oh, you're from Pennsylvania. Yeah. What's up, dude? Hey, how's it going? What's your name? My name's Tyler. Um, I'm out here with my wife, Taylor. Uh huh. Tyler and Taylor. We awesome. Just got, we just got married in Vegas and we're backpacking Arizona. Oh, right. congratulations, man. Yeah. But I have such a good recipe and they taste like better than carne asada tacos. Oh my, my goodness. Okay, she just prepared the Mexican dishes. Looks amazing. Um, I think we're gonna take the food and take it inside of Raptor Ranch. She said there's tables in there where you can sit down and enjoy it too, so. You wanna get a shout out? <laughs> uh, Shout out. How's it going, Troy? Hey, how you doing? How you doing? <laughs> Got the food from Sunshine and Delights. Pleasure to meet Lena and her son. Guys, let's just get started here. We're having the food at Raptor Ranch and went and picked up to some of their feature items. They don't have a very, very big menu. These are the loaded nachos that they serve here. They have regular nachos, but I you know, said so let's just go for the loaded ones to show show off what uh, what they have. Okay, pick that up. Just like that. All right, here we go. Maybe add a jalapeno on top. Okay, loaded nachos here, and bite. Oh my goodness. No, oh wow, that cheese. And you can tell by that the amount of cheese she put on there. She was very generous with the cheese. Those pieces of bacon bits with the crumbled queso fresca and the jalapeno too. Lots of texture in that, and that's mighty delicious. Grab another piece. And she also added her salsa too, her homemade salsa. Forgot to mention that. Uh, it kind of gives it a nice tinge of heat too, not too much. I think that heat is coming from the jalapeno. With that said, I will add a jalapeno on here. Okay. And bite. That's good. Wow. Mm. Mexican street food nachos. Okay. Without getting too full, I'm gonna put that away and move on to the next box here. Let's go with this. And then this wasn't on the menu. It's called the Sunshine Dog. And she adds bits of bacon, or not just bits, like kind of like slices of bacon. She adds the onions and her salsa. 
uh, some mustard and ketchup, I believe. And the queso fresca. I love the Mexican style hot dogs because they do add that bacon. Here we go. And bite. Oh, that bacon shooks out. The saltiness from the bacon, the crispiness from the bacon as well. The ketchup and mustard and the queso fresco, and that entire bacon dog combination, the sunshine dog combination, wow. I love how she laid on those ingredients from placing that tortilla on the grill, lathered it with a little bit of oil to give it some crispiness. You have the pork that she cooked and then she laid on some of these cabbage bits, the queso fresca, and then she added her salsa as well. And then she didn't move with her with the lime, just kind of tossed it in there. I'm gonna sprinkle some lime on that right now. Just like, just like that. And these are the carnitas, the pork taco. And bite. I'm gonna stay it, I'm gonna stay it. I'm sorry Fred Harvey's food truck, but might need to add the um, Sunshine Delight pop-up up there in the Grand Canyon. That's fire. Street food tacos, the flavors, the care put into it as she prepared it. Back to the taco, that pork, man. That shredded carnitas pork, there's flavor into that. You know that she added some type of marinade in there, a little bit of barbecue flavor. The texture from the cabbage, that salsa, the cheese, the tortilla, man. That lime, a little bit of acidity. That is delicious, man. That is just like supreme, love it. They only serve two meat items, which is the pork, and then they have chicken. The chicken tacos, again, same variation. You have that cabbage, kind of a, like a dry slaw, and then you have the queso fresca, and then you have that salsa. Sprinkle some lime on that. Okay, all right, here we go. I'm gonna take the first bite of this chicken taco, and bite. Mm. The chicken is a bit dry, but the consistency of her ingredients, from the cabbage, the salsa, the queso fresco, adding that lime, the tortilla, kind of make that taco, regardless if the chicken is dry. I prefer the, the pork taco though. All right, gonna finish up some food here as we enjoy our sit down at the prehistoric Fred Friendstone Ranch, the Raptor Ranch, the Sean and Safi. Hi, yum. <laughs> nice to meet you here. Nice you know, to meet we're here you. at the uh, Raptor Ranch. Oh. Troy Turan, that's the owner, Troy. Moore. Oh, Troy. Oh, oh you're outside there earlier. Yeah, yeah Troy. <laughs> Nice. Awesome. Look at the bird. Lacey, a peregrine <laughs> falcon. She's one yeah. of the peregrine falcons are the fastest animal in the world. That's wow. cool. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Later. Yeah, that's a good Keep an eye on our what, Facebook and, and Instagram for next year for our Oh, for family. sure. We'll have a lot more and hopefully a restaurant or a deli or something. Okay. I'll, I'll come back. We just had the food from Sunshine Delight. Amazing, loved it. I love everything about Mexican street food. I love everything. I love your your rendition of it. Yes. Where can people follow you guys? Yeah, so we have Instagram, Facebook, we have um, our website, okay. but mostly social media, Sunshine Delights AZ. Awesome, so check them out guys, check them out. If you're ever passing by, going to the Grand Canyon, do stop by here, Raptor Ranch, and then check out uh, Lena and her family here. So good, thank you. Thank you guys. <laughs> okay, I think that'll do it here. We're gonna close it up here in Raptor Ranch, Yabba Dabba Doo, the Flintstones Village. If you're gonna go to Grand Canyon, it's about 22 miles going north. This will conclude our food tour. We'll be headed back to California. It's about 12 hour drive. Yeah, with that, so I want to thank you guys for watching this video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up if you like it. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I greatly appreciate that. Peace out. One love late. Don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on post notifications so you don't miss a thing. All right, later.